so we're getting ready to go into the Dollar Tree. So if you want to see what we pick up, stay tuned. Yeah. Dollar Tree haul, right Jackson? Let me see if I can find it. I'm gonna find um Jackson got a little SpongeBob toy. Okay guys. So the first thing we found is this little SpongeBob figurine. Um and these are all the ones that you can collect. Um uh, our store had the Stimpy, had the Wren, had the Arnold. Um but they did not have the Patrick anymore, so um which is Maybe they'll get them back in. I don't know. Jackson really wanted a SpongeBob, but it'd be really cute to find the Patrick to go along with him. But there's that. Jackson got a balloon also. Show off your balloon. He got an I love you Valentine balloon. So cute. All right, let's see. Um, oh, this, they should not have put this in the bag with. Okay guys, the next thing I got is this cool sponge. Um, I saw um, only in my dreams. I saw her showing this off at her, on her channel, and I thought this would be really fun for Jackson to just play with in the bathtub. You know, it's like the old timey kind of sponge, natural bath sponge. Um, so I picked that up, and then I got three of the lavender, and I got the ones that are purple and white. Um, so I thought these were really cute. I picked those up. I'm probably gonna do a DIY with those. Uh, I got this bag of Crafter Square Spanish Moss. Um, I got this, of course, for a craft. Jackson saw these, and I've been looking at these for a while now. Um, so Jackson saw this. This is from Garden Collection, the Wind Twister. He wanted the heart one. Um, so we picked this up to go on our front porch. What else did we get in this bag? Um, I picked up this little lunch tray. I thought this was cute. It's microwave safe. Um, they had two different kinds and I picked up the first kind and it was not microwave safe. So I went ahead and picked this one up. Jackson does not like it when his food touches. Um, so he gets kind of upset about it. So I thought this would be really nice to have and it's bigger. I have a small one from when he was a toddler um, that we still use every once in a while. But this will be nice because we can actually put a decent amount of food on here for him to eat. I got two of these little um, little organizers for pencils and pens and stuff. One of these is for Jackson and the other one is for me in the craft room. Um, okay, I think, oh no, that's not it in this bag. The last thing in this bag is the uh, Garden Collection Twist Tie with Cutter. Uh, there's two spools here. I picked this up because I thought this would be good for some DIYs. Um, cheap and easy for like, you know, tying things and um, keeping things together. So I'm going to shove all this back in this bag and set that bag down there. Um, the next thing I found is the, uh, the Glade Lemon Fresh. This smells so good, you guys. Um, I picked up four cans of this because I don't know how long they're going to have it. I saw Pookie over at Pookie's, Pookie's, Pookie's View. Sorry. Um, go check her channel out. And again, check out um, Only in My Dreams, too. Um, great channels. They do hauls, uh, DIYs, stuff like that. So anyway, so I saw Pookie over at Pookie's View um, sharing this and I had to find it. You guys know lemon. I love lemon. Um, so this is Lemon Fresh from Glade. Uh, I got four of those. And I just picked up this small little thing of Downy, Ultra, Ultra Downy April Fresh uh, fabric softener. This does 12 loads. There is 10 fluid ounces in here. So um, I picked that up because I'm out of fabric softener. Um, and I usually use the, like the, what am I trying to say? I usually like use the scent beads or the, um, the unstoppables. I use those a lot. Um, but yeah, I ran out and I saw that and Jackson wanted that for some reason. So I said, okay, we'll get it. Um, I picked up one of these floral garden willow wreaths. This of course is for a DIY. I also picked up some of these Crafter Square wood dowels. There's 15 in here. I figured these would be good for um, some DIYs too. Not sure what I'm going to use them for, but it's always good to have things like that on hand. I got two packs of the Crafter Square glue sticks. Always a good purchase to have those. Jackson really wanted some bubble gum, um, and he found the double bubble in the original flavor. This is just the regular bubble gum. Uh, usually they've had like the fruit ones at our store, but not the... Um, 
the regular ones and he likes the regular flavor. My husband needed some more soap. He uses the Dial Gold Soap. There's two bars in here for a dollar. Um, you can pick this up. You can pick these up at like Food Lion. I think he gets these from Food Lion for a three pack for a dollar thirty something. Um, so two bars for a dollar is pretty good. Um, but either way, um, I got two boxes of the Welch's fruit snacks. This is the strawberry fruit snacks. And then I got a box of the berries and cherries. Uh, there is four packs in each box. Uh, these are good for Jackson's lunches during the week. And then the last thing I found, I have not seen this there before. We're going to try this. Um, we use a lot of basil pesto at our house for, um, I have a nice a chicken tender recipe that we use this for. Um, and of course we use it for like, I put it in spaghetti sauce and stuff like that when I want the basil flavor. Um, so this is a 6.5 ounce jar of Monta, Montalbano. I don't know how to say, it's not going to focus because it's sunny out here. Montal, Montalbano basil pesto. Um, so we're going to try this. It is Italian basil, Italian cheese, and extra virgin olive oil. Um, so we're going to try this. I hope it's good. If it's good, we might actually start picking that up from the Dollar Tree while they have it. Um, we might try to stock up on it because, yeah, because we use a lot of pesto at our house too. Uh, so that is it, you guys, for our Dollar Tree haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you like this video, please hit the thumbs up. Please subscribe if you haven't. You can join our little family here on our corner of YouTube. Um, and stay tuned for more videos, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.